Welcome to the Invasion Session 8 Part 2. It is the 3rd of June 2020. I am Ryan, GM, and here are the players. Hi there, my name is Gregor. I play Adair, who is a Air Genasi and a little bit of a rogue. Hey, I'm Scott. I am playing a uh, Gnome Artificer called Alvin. Hi, I'm Calman, and I am playing Cognac. Good evening, my name is Alexander, and tonight I'm playing Fleabite, the past landscape. Hello, I'm Ewan, and I'm playing Lyuda, the Loxodon Druid, who's going to have to come up with a new wild shape because he's getting as drunk as a skunk. Oh! <laughs> Hello there. I am the other cow. Excuse me, I had a biscuit in my mouth. I'm playing a very sad theatre or priestess of chaos. Uh -huh. And then Kyle Mem might want to tell us that he's a turtle barbarian or not. Who knows? Just, just oh, to nobody know. know. But we do, because you are. Nobody um, knows. Nobody knows. Uh, yeah. So can I just like just, be able to roll a class every time we enter combat? No. And it's like based on a roll twenty or something. No. Did you add those things to your character sheet yet? By the way. The cloaks. Yeah. Good man. They don't show up as like. They won't. Um, yeah, but they're in my inventory. Good, good. Right, so we're back here. I am in Runestead, surprisingly. And. Wait, what? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Um, uh, amazing. And um, Fleabite, however. Is ticking. Fleabite? Oh, yeah, Fleabite's a bomb. Yeah. I think I'm so, still unconscious. So, from your perspective, you sniff and huff the uh, the green okay. mists, and uh, I know I heard it too. And um, you sniff and huff the the green mists and the I guess like debris of the stone that was crushed by Lauda for you, and you're immediately like vaulted backwards. I am um, as you like from your point of view you fall backwards but you keep falling um, until you hit like a, a big rocky kind of surface in the dark um, to everybody else's point of view you just fall off the table and hit the deck um, but for you you fall down in the dark and you hit really kind of like uneven terrain it like, feels like rock beneath you you pick yourself up and you look around and there's just um, swirling green vortexes of energy off in the distance that seem to like sometimes pass by other masses of just like rock floating only lit by these green vortexes off in the distance and there's like hundreds possibly thousands of them in all directions uh, I guess we might would start on all four scurrying towards the nearest one Okay, so you start scurrying forward and then you realise that you're starting to like just walk over the edges of the chunk of rock that you seem to be on that seems to be floating on its own. Can I tentatively paw just at the, uh, the, the void, I guess? <laughs> See if there's anything that I can like. It's, uh, I'm imagining something like Indiana Jones for a leap of faith. I mean, there's no, no nothing tangible to touch, but there are other like kind of like chunks of landmass. I am floating, I occasionally lit by these big green swirls that appear and disappear. I mean, close enough to leap to. I mean, what is close enough, right? In a dark void of green swirly energy and random floating chunks of rock, right? Um... Fair enough. <laughs> I. Um... Take a, a good run up and then leap to this as well. Yeah, so like you run, you push off the rock that you're on, you just slowly start drifting. Um and you see like the rock in front of you like slowly like turning and twisting in the dark. And then obviously the the green energy as it like appears and disappears. And then all of a sudden there is like a, a flood of green light that hits you as one of the vortexes like overlaps flea bite. Um, and with that kind of like surge of like power like pulsing through you, you just 
<laughs> you wake up and hit your head off the table. <laughs> so to everybody else, there's a thud from under the table. <laughs> Yes, that was a good hit. <laughs> probably just stay under the table for a moment or two. <laughs> yeah, you probably recognize the boots of people, right? Um, but yeah. The no. locks that on boots look like. I don't know if you wear boots. I don't think you do. Mm. I'm not sure, but I don't think locks on wear boots. Um, they just have their elephant boots. Did you know elephants stand on their tiptoes? No, I think I did know that. Uh, no, I don't. I'm I don't also, think I like, still know that. Dubious enough to like fact check. That. Yeah, that's true. But, um, but yeah, so there is a thud from underneath the table. Fleabite wakes up and says that was a good hit. <laughs> uh -huh. And yeah, yeah, they're still in the um, tavern. I think maybe. Uh, there... oh, sorry. Does the dare want to ask why he was ticking? <laughs> it's eating away at me. I didn't know seems... that. He was away. Adair is only just back. I am back. I am... Sorry, I was away there. There was noises outside. I had to check on. It's okay. What did I miss? Who wants to fill him in? Uh, Fleabite just woke up and smacked his head off the uh, bottom of the table. I'm glad you jumped in really quickly because there was going to be like a me, but someone else can tell him what happened. I feel like that's all that he needs to know at the moment. Still with it, there? Nope, I think he's a. Uh... Uh, his green light's there, but yeah. oh, he's gone. Yep. Um, well, um, I was just going to say maybe, maybe. Um... At that point, Theo was going into extreme detail as to what actually happened to Lauda, seeing as Lauda was showing some sort of interest. And then the thud happens, and it just kind of snapped her out of her um, tail, mm -hmm. as it were. And maybe she's um, close to finishing off her picture. Yeah, I think um, Lauda would say, um, I, I understand um, your pain here. I'm very sorry for this event and I um like to offer you any assistance you may you may need in helping to remedy this uh, wrongdoing. Mm. I mean I think she would say something like um uh, good start, good start would be pass pass me pass me pass me another picture please. I pass her another picture and yes, hold that mine to cheers. Uh, maybe maybe that's when um like the the thud happens and her her attention is um drawn towards that thudding of the table. Well, if I don't get a cheers, I guess I just start drinking from the picture again. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um so sorry, I am back uh after being away, Discord kicked me off, so mm -hmm. what did I miss? <laughs> Everything. Fleabout woke up, oh. hit his head off the table. Right. You had been staring at him, remember, because he was ticking. Yes. Um, so I would have looked down at Fleabat and gone, are, are you back? Are, are you with us? Also, were you ticking? <laughs> was it Blue Elf? Blue Winding meant to know. What was that, Fleabat? <laughs> Blue Winding wants to steal tick tick. Uh, what is the... Tick tick and ah, no, he wants to steal it. Probably Levi, we've been we've been together for over a year, you know I don't steal from the simple. Have you actually stolen anything yet? No, I'm not that kind of rogue. And that's why you fail. <laughs> I'm gonna steal everything from you though. <laughs> Primarily your heart. Dun 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 Nah, Tiger's a gun. <laughs> Language, Scotty. It was a dare I was speaking you. about. How dare you? Uh, it, really? Because it was Gregor I was talking about. So <laughs> anyway. I know. Sorry. Keep your drama out of the game. <laughs> I only want game drama in the game. 
Um, I'll give you a game. So does Fleabite uh, stay under the table or sit up on a chair next to the table? Um, um, I think Fleabite climbs back onto the table. Okay. Fleabite, what was ticking? I mean, it's still ticking if you're listening. <laughs> Fleabite, why are you ticking? No tick ticks. It is all in your mind, mind. Can I? I'll leave. No, after you. What was that? Just after you. I wanted to chime in, but it doesn't matter. Um, how loud is this ticking? Is it like getting attraction from no, other it's, patrons it's, in the bar, or it's quite faint? Does it sound like? A, would I recognize this sound like a pocket watch kind of ticking, or is this a distinctive? Ticking. Just a ticking. Right. <laughs> yep. Well, if Fleabite's not reacting like he's about to blow up, then I'm fine. Can I then just chuck a copper at Fleabite and ask him what's ticking? Yeah, I think Fleabite would sort of eye the, the copper, um, like give it a bite, make sure it's real, stash it away. And then say, free bite uh, acquired um, tick tick from um, from man things, and then also got uh, warp stone stone. Where is the uh, uh, gnome thing? I need his finger mix. <laughs> you need my what? Uh, you, heard, <laughs> you, heard, you, heard, you heard him. Rule thirty four. We love. Love, love. <laughs> so yeah, they didn't, they didn't like actually respond to Fleabite saying, "Where is the gnome?" Um, Alvin's not here right now. Please leave a message. <laughs> I don't think any of us even know where he is. So no, uh, you know, um, you said he was going to go to the library. Did you not? Like that, you were walking yeah. with him to the library. I don't know. I don't know where yeah, the library is. Happened. I don't think that happened. Did it? I think yeah, that, I said that was going to the library. It's why you okay. left because you walked with him to the library, but you just mm. didn't continue because he kept going and you got flea baited. And uh, you yes. flea went to the shop, so all that did happen. So yeah. no, he was heading to the library. Assumedly, he is probably still. Yeah, I remember there. the walking part. I just don't remember him saying, but it must have happened. I mean, that's how I totally remember that by. <laughs> is so yeah, Fleabite, like you're eating? chicken. Uh, we haven't ordered food for the table. Uh, is this the kind of tavern that would have food? Yeah, sure. People are eating already. Yeah. Do you remember they were having lunch? Yeah, they were having lunch. Well, I can't, for some reason, I had it in my head. They had their own pack lunch kind of thing. Like, I had this as a weekend kind of <laughs> drinks place. It's got a sign on the wall saying, you can't eat unless you've bought it from here. <laughs> No pack lunches. Only pack lunches. <laughs> um, so, is there a menu then? Nope. Um, yeah. I mean, I guess we haven't ate yet, so. Okay, um, I would venture up to the bar and ask what think, food they are serving. I think if a deer stood up, I think Theo would uh, look at a deer and be like, oh, um,. Could, it, could, I have, could I have a nail, please? Thank you. And turn back to the table and continue. Um, I was going to say sipping on her um, picture, but sipping might be the word. I, I would offer to get you another glass, um, but we do have dinner this evening with the kingship, Lord Wizard. Oh, excellent. How much do you, do you want? Another pitcher or just a glass? Just just a, just an ale, please. I just an ale. Okay. Uh, Thank you. Mm, I just uh, looked down at the pitcher. It's probably got about half left in it, and I just say, I think this should do with me. With that fuck up of words in the middle of it as well. Yeah, and I think uh, maybe you'd give me your recon save here. <laughs> <laughs> Suitable. 
Oh, damn. Woo! Yep, you're somehow... Big 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 your, your metabolism is doing its work, right? Yeah. Elephants always remember. So, so thank you. <laughs> At this point, um, I would turn to Thea and be like, um, you know, Thea, um, I am much older than most people of this world, other than obviously the others of my kind, but um, the staff that I lost this morning, I crafted that um, when I was forcibly removed from my home. It was uh, crafted from the last the last tree I had in my garden. Um, it was very dear to me. And I've had it for over 300 years. Longer you than... old motherfucker. Longer than most of the lifetimes of people in this city to have it destroyed um, so carelessly um, I put a snigger from <laughs> <laughs> well, like I do still standing the there kind of going so you do want another drink I, I said that the half picture will do me okay it's just when you started going into the story about that, I was like, are you sure you don't want another stronger drink? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. That surprised me. Glass of water it is. I mean, no. <laughs> glass of something that is. And, uh... Um, yeah, I think that I just sort of want to get across the sentimentality. And I, uh, I feel like I am, um, on this occasion, possibly I'm more understanding than others of the the loss of a treasured item, or damage, in this case. Has pale boat man thing lost more stuff? Mm. No. Or just think... bad boat boat? So I could say one more thing, just, um, I don't see any particular means of getting my my loss back or retribution for that without setting a course some unfortunate events for the entire city but uh, I'd be more than happy to assist you in whatever means you need to get your own vengeance I think Thea's face does a lot of things with all the things that have gone on so um, while Laird was talking, I think Thea would have maybe a, a, she would be kind of frowning, but maybe more of a forced frown. Um, as Laird was talking about their stick, um, and daring to compare it to the importance of her masks, um, and then when Fleabite said her thing, her frown would actually turn into an actual frown. Um, and maybe a few tears would um, show on her face. Um, and then the last part um, where Lida was uh, saying it was that you would you would help. Um, you take or enact your vengeance. Yeah, I think um, her like maybe her her maybe maybe she would kind of um, start to to cry a little bit, uh, and then like her crying would turn into like a slight like, giggle and then into a wee bit of laughter um, as, as she would say something along the lines of <laughs> hellfire will fall upon her and her so called city <laughs> I just and she's like a... half sobbing, half laughing, half Thing. Yeah, Maybe that's... she would have given Fleabite a, a bit of like a, a glare as well hmm. at, at the boat comment. Um, well, I would, would give a, a slight laugh and nod and then drink the rest of the uh, pitcher in one go. <laughs> so the uh, waiter guy comes over to the table uh, and clears away whatever's empty. Um, while the rat is sitting on the table. Yeah, like, he clears the rat away as well. 
Like, yep, because the rat, <laughs> the rat isn't um, empty, sadly. So no. If if the rat if uh, if the rat came over, if the waiter came over, um, I think Theo would do that thing when he was there picking up the empties. You know, try and like drink the the pitcher mm. so he doesn't have to make Another more trip. trips. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Um. So just kind of downs that and then kind of slides it over. Maybe there's a dribble left at the bottom. Um. Uh, excuse me, Miss. There, there's a message for you behind the bar. I am um, just whenever you're. You're ready, and then he quickly scurries off with all the the stuff awkwardly in his arms. I think that's when my jaw would open, and I'd turn to Theo and go, oh, "It's a message from him." I think and tap Theo on the shoulder. I think the I think Thea's face is like as expressionless as her expressionless mask used to be. <laughs> Uh, I, she just, like, I think she just like calmly stands up and just walks over to the bar. Oh, I'll tell you, like he's flirting with the. Uh... <laughs> so you head up to the bar, and uh, yeah, it's the the owner behind the bar at the moment. So she's just there with her, you know, hands on her hips. She kind of nods at you. He goes. What can I do for you, my dear? I believe there is a message. Eh? Hey? She like furrows her brow a bit. She kind of like looks behind the bar and looks around. She's like, um, I don't see any. And then like the the waiter that has been speaking to you like runs up very quickly. He's like, it's, it's okay, I've got this one. Thanks, Myra. Um, Can I just say I would have like moved over towards the seat a wee and have like an eye looking across at the bar. Sure, yeah. And uh... can I also shout to Thea, food. <laughs> um, so he's like, do you have any beetles? So he says he he, he stands there and he's like after like uh, the the owner like moves away, um, and kind of like fixes his shirt and tucks it into his pants and then he's like hey, um, are, are you going to be in, in town long? Hmm. I think Thea shouts across like the bar Are we going to be in town long? <laughs> Adair shouts back Not that long! We're working for the king! Lord Chip, man. Wizard. There's a bunch of looks, obviously. More so than the ones that are just staring at Fleabite on the table. <laughs> <laughs> I think um, Sia would just nod and say. What? That one said? And she's definitely, like, playing with her, um, her, um, formerly expressionless mask. He says, because uh, I was thinking that maybe to kind of cheer you up a bit, because I, I noticed you, you were a bit teary. Um, maybe you'd like... I think maybe she would try and wipe some, like, make sure there were, like, no no tears visible. And she was, like, kind of, like, wiping her face as he said, mm -hmm. teary. And, um, like, I was maybe, maybe thinking you'd, you'd maybe cheer you up if you could come maybe help you feed, feed the horses. He's kind of like running the hand through the back of his hair, awkwardly. Horses. In the distance, you just hear, "Oh, coming from me." I mean, you probably I can't hear he... this exchange. I... Yeah, as okay. like you can, you can hear them shouting, but like, you, you oh, there's I can't definitely what you're saying. No, because there's too many people between you and the bar. Um, but just those gestures. I mean, you can still see that he's clearly awkward talking to her, so yeah, you can still have that yeah. reaction. Um, oh yeah, I'm totally doing that then. I'm just like, oh. I don't think Thea's picking up on any of that, mm -hmm. but um, I think she'll, 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 I think she'll just say to him, "I, I am unsure if I like horses. Horses 
And then I think she would um, she would grab like the sad mask off the top of her head, and then the formerly expressionless mask, and maybe kind of um, like having like maybe the formerly expressionless mask in her left hand, like put it over her face, and then put the sad one over her face, and then put the thing and keep swapping them around, and kind of watching him, and then maybe she parts like both hands, put them down to her side, and cocks her eyebrow and goes, "Horses, horses sound good." And he, like, his awkward, slightly confused, mildly terrified look kind of, like, dissolves away into, like, like a smile that maybe reaches his face before it reaches his brain, right? And mm-hmm. uh, he, he smiles at it. Uh, good. Um, I finish here in, in, a, in, like, an hour, I am, and then I, then I go feed horses if you, you, you want to meet me outside in, like, an hour. I was going to say Thea looks at her watch. She doesn't have a watch. Oh, she looks um, at her phone, right? <laughs> tick, 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 tick. In 60 cycles. Um, yes. In 60 cycles, <laughs> yes. Ah, okay. That's, that's, that's words I understand. Yes. Um, <laughs> I think she'll, like, lean on the bar and um, say, okay, uh, wine, please. Uh, sure. Sure. Um, Miss, and then he like turns around and goes off and gets more wine. Is it a pitcher you're ordering, or? Yep. Yep. So again, two silver. I think two it silver. Was. Yes, it was. Am which I is much easier to do now that I've um, call over and ask for another. So he wanders off, gets you your pitcher, and then later you see onto the head up to the the bar with you. I'd like to just sort of call across and say, could you get me one too? And, and then again. I hold up a couple of silver. I would say at that point, that's when I would just jump back up because it was my round. I was going to say, you can so, see, see, if you're watching her, you can see the picture arrive, but you can't hear her remember um, from that mm-hmm. far away. So yeah, you can just like go up and talk to her or shout at her now. Um, but once when... the picture arrives, that's when I get back up because... Mm-hmm. I would nod to Lauda, like, my round, don't worry, still on it. Okay. Also yeah. food. So I'll then I'd, yeah, I'd make my way over to the When he says also food, here. does a Cognac say anything about the fact that you've got dinner arrangements? What's this lunchtime? Like, oh, you said it was like, I suppose maybe by that it was like 12, so now it's probably one, so probably not. Yeah, okay. As Adair stands up and walks away, I uh, reach over the table and grab the remainder of the fine wine and start to drink it out of the bottle. Sure, yeah. So if, he clearly damn you, but yeah, yeah. That's fair enough. I think there, I, is, there is like that one last glass left in it, right? So, mm-hmm. yeah. Can I uh, see it, that? It like that last glass where you keep pouring it and it's like just dribbling, but it keeps just going just <laughs> enough and it just fills the glass. So, you just, you. so Cognac, what were you saying? Sorry. Can I see this? Ball and being from a noble house, at least recognize perhaps it's vintage or whatever. It's fine wine. There's no label, it's in a green bottle. Okay. So probably um, not. Could I ask what it is? To who? What are you drinking? There you go. There. <laughs> <It's fine. laughs> I beat you too, it was bait. Yep. Because I know what you're like. I see you're a master baiter. Why do we say um, they didn't have any of the bottles I'm familiar with? So just just wine, just wine. Uh, I have some superb wine. Uh, Oh really? I guess so. I pass him that. I'm getting a picture anyway. And I, I slowly take a sip. Mm -hmm. Can I do a roll to see if I recognize it then? I mean, sure, yeah, why not? Or just like whether I notice it's really good? I mean, it is really good. You don't really need to roll to notice, but why don't you give me a perception check for some taste? Hmm. This isn't grape. This is human! (laughs) (laughs) I don't. Just screams and turns. Ah, it's definitely wine. Yes. It's wine. Not, it's not like the maybe wine Scots used to. Um, oh, maybe, wine, maybe wine's amazing. 
maybe wine is terrible. You should never drink maybe wine. Um, but yes, hey, yeah. Wine. I got. So we I have got a spare room. room. I got a sword out of maybe wine, so... You... Maybe he's born with it, maybe it's wine? Maybe it's maybe wine. Um, uh, watch, see, watch the uh, Keepers of the Golden is... Gate. <laughs> what oh, I okay, I thought are... this was a real thing. No. Are you guys referring to another game, with yes. Scott? Yes. yes. See, what I love is I jump into what I know Scott drinks. Yes. Exactly. So that's why I was that's laughing. That's why everyone was like, is this in hey, real I... life or is this in the I have not game? drank said thing in a very long time. So... I have, but you mention it every year for your birthday. Meanwhile, <laughs> in our game right now. Yes. Uh, yes. Cognac, you you think it maybe tastes familiar to something you've drank in your parents' house, but you, I mean, that was so long ago, you don't, you're not sure. Mm. But it could, I mean, expensive wine all tastes the same. So, yeah. as opposed to all like the cures. Mm. This is and especially after good. a picture of cheap this wine. Is, this is really good. You know, it's it's not what we're used to having. Is it? It's just expensive. I just say yes. It was good. <laughs> You're not asking, answering my question. Did, uh... It was easily covered. Yes. Funny that. Uh, can I get my 20 gold back? Oh, but have you not seen this wonderful quarterstaff that I've purchased? He's a stick. <laughs> it's a nice stick. Sorry! <laughs> 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 you know the heritage of this wood? Ethically so. I don't know, but it looks like a bird to me. <laughs> this was ethically so. Ethically, ethically so. Any <laughs> character here. You've been swindled, mate. <clears throat> and as if I. I think I know some fine wood when I see it. Wink! Wink to the bar, man. Amazing! <laughs> Hmm. Well, we can run a tab. Do you owe me? Hmm. Fair enough. It's like he knew I was going to go up to the bar and ask if we could start a tab. <laughs> <laughs> well, for the food and the drink. You know, we're good for it. We've already paid so much. so With interest. <laughs> well, service no. charge and tip, of course. Paid almost 21 gold so far. Ah. <laughs> so, we fade out from you guys and go back to Alvin. Yay, that's me! Yep, and you've just watched this woman walk in in some ripply heat special effects, wave at you, you wave at her, she smiles at you, she's got a big, kind of, very sparkly grin that she gives you, mm. uh, and then you wave back and try and speak, you realise you can't speak. And you jump down onto your feet, and then you look up, and she just walks through the wall, like the door, um, that is like locked and guarded, and like the she's rune, a motherfucking dragon. The rune guard don't um, react either, cause she's a dragon, and it's gonna be his mum. Uh, sorry, um, yeah. So I uh, kind of go up to the guards and be like, um, who is that? Clarify. The lady that just came in. There has been no visitors beyond yourself today. That is a lie, my friend. You are not doing a good job. If you are dissatisfied with my service, you can submit a report. Mm. I need to get through those gates now. You have missed an intruder coming in. Your request is rejected. Your king is in danger. I will pass on your concern. That's purely to avoid saying your concern is noted. Because mm -hmm. I feel like saying your concern is noted doesn't feel like he's passed it anywhere. You yeah. Know? But he will have. I'm like, <laughs> don't pass on my concern. We need to react. No. goes back to carding. 
I am. I run up and try and open the gate. Yeah, it's just a big locked gate. It's like. Like none of the guards oh, even move I... to stop you because like you just like hit into the wall and bash against it. I'm like. Guards, I am a guest of the king, so please open the gate or you are going to be in so much trouble! If you could please return to the waiting area until you are summoned. I am taking it upon myself to summon myself to help the king because he's clearly in danger. The fact that you have malfunctioned and missed an intruder, a quite attractive intruder albeit, I think she liked me. I mean, maybe I have a shot. No, sorry, again, side. No, no, focus on. No, let me in. You have to. If you would like to remain seated in the waiting area, you will be summoned when requested. Gravity mm. ball. Ghost of Fleabite floats by. <laughs> Get out of here, meta ghost. Uh, I just feel like a useless bag of bolts. I could make better. I could make a better guard out of some scrap. I just said there's nothing. There's not no reply, yeah. Do you know where the rest of my companions are? Your companions seem to be in the marketplace. Fine. Maybe they'll help me. Pretty sure an elephant could knock down that bloody gate. And then I just run out uh, to go find my party. Yeah. Then we've got like flock of seagulls run playing in the background as you bolt all the way there. Um, <laughs> boo, boo, doo, 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 doo. <laughs> um There you go. Yeah, and I think um we we'll probably fade back in on <laughs> you, Alvin, running up against the window, staring in, watching um Thea carry a picture back from the uh, the bar, I guess. I'm watching like the Air Genesee heading towards the the bar. But I'd be at the bar at that point talking to them about food. Oh, as I discussed just two seconds ago. Yeah, never mind. You get you get to the <laughs> bar. So what would you like to discuss with the bar staff? So, um, we, there appear to be a lot of people eating. Uh, what is the menu options? Uh, what what's on? What's the house special? There is there is um, soup and bread. I uh, we got some uh, some meat. Got a stew. That's mm -hmm. that's about it for now until until later. What is the soup? Hey, and he kind of like he looks over at like this big pot that's over like an open fire. And he's like, probably overdone. Ah, so can can you tell me is it gluten free? He looks. He goes. What, what's a gluten? Oh my god! <laughs> I couldn't help it. Oh, my is going crazy. <laughs> and why are they free? <laughs> Oh, uh, no, that's absolutely fine. Um, it's, I kind it's, of it's, gesture... it's got all sorts of vegetables in it, but I don't, don't think there's no meat in, in the soup. There's, I don't know what a gluten is, but we, we, we don't have them in these parts. Uh, oh, so it's a vegetarian soup. And he just kind of looks and he goes, it's got vegetables in it. Yes, yes. I will look towards the table and just kind of gesture like, soup. Four, five, four. You see Alvin staring out oh. the window. Oh my god, he leaves. 
I see Alvar at the window. Give him the finger. <laughs> it looks like the hungry bee child outside the window. Mm-hmm. I just do that whole like, t- like point to my eyes and then point to him, and then start running towards the door. Yeah, and you just like hop down from the the window sill, run around and go in the door. <laughs> yep. So everybody kind of have a look and goes, "There's another one." <laughs> I'll, I'll quickly tell the bar staff and um, the, the wee fellow that's coming in. Um, <clears throat> He's with us, but don't serve him, please. Well, all right. Uh, what, what, why would they? Because he drops stuff a lot. Oh. Give him a couple of drinks, gravity bombs everywhere. Like his eyes kind of glaze over. <clears throat> uh, but no. Um, and yeah, let's order some soup. Um, I'm assuming everyone would be happy with we light soup. You're a light soup. Wee. Thea will not drink her soup or eat her soup. Fair warning, but you can still burn it. But would a deer know that? But that's um, what I just put that out there just in case a deer wanted I, to know. I'm, I'm gesturing yeah. at the table. I can see Thea's very upset, so I maybe want her to have the soup, so I'll bring mm. it over. Okay, yeah, yeah, that makes the sense. Three silver per bowl. Ooh, okay. Um, <laughs> it's not tingled. Uh, well, I guess it was my round, so yes, uh, that's absolutely fine with me. And the wine? Well, how much booze did uh, the actually take back with? Just a picture. Damn it! Yes. Are I you buying that? Oh, that. I'm. I'm. I'll happily like put that to go back. No, no, that was that was all you. That was all you, Thea. Oh, okay, I wasn't okay. there in the bar yet. <laughs> okay, that's fine. But no, um, I'm getting your soup. You know, I'm taking care of you. You know. Uh, but yeah, I'll pay for the soup for most and booze so, for everyone who wanted. I think so, as you were going to the bar, I was holding up two silver as if to say I wanted a picture again. Oh no, I'll get you a picture anyway. Cool. So. No, no, it was my round, so fair is fair. So have you spent your money? Apart from math, I'm to, uh, have, uh, have bought your, uh, your picture. I have spent my money, yes. Good, good. Excellent. So, um, Ryan, can I just clarify how much did that in total cost me? I'm terrible at math, so I do apologize. So it's three silver per bowl. Three silver per bowl. Right. So three times and six. 18. Yep. How many bowls did I just get? Six. Six. Oh, damn. So it's 18. Okay. So it's essentially two gold, and you get, what, two silver back? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm attempting for this to work, but I'm using my tablet, so I do apologize. Actually, Ryan, you can see if I do this wrong or right, right? Sure. Yeah, I need to give myself 112 gold there. Try not to. Do it anyway. Just <laughs> no. If the GM needs 112 gold, that'll do. Uh, right, there we go. I believe that's me up to date. So that was the booze. No, that was just the soup, I believe. So your silver actually goes up, not down. Yep. Uh, so it goes to oh, nine. No, of course. My bad. It's okay. See, like I said, I'm terrible with numbers, so... This is why I'm clarifying. I don't want to be known as a liar, and uh, so yeah. Liar, uh, so you, don't realize, um, you don't realize how real that is, by the way. Um, <laughs> <laughs> for a completely unrelated <laughs> thing, by the way. <laughs> Reopen Discord. Um, <laughs> it was too good for that. Yeah. It's, it's also just so apt for things you're not probably aware of yet. Um, <laughs> But yes, so that's your money sorted now. And that was just for the, the soup. What type of wine? Did you want the a picture soup. of wine or did you want... Um... Um, well, I believe, Lyoda, you were wanting... Um, he... Were you wanting the fine stuff again? I mean, yeah, if you're offering. I mean, that's more gold than I've got, so... Um... You say, yeah, girlfriend. <laughs> I said, yeah, if you're offering. <laughs> <laughs> Lyoda's had so much that he's like, yeah, go for it. <laughs> so <laughs> I'll just get him some nice wine, a uh, picture of wine. <laughs> he's, he's clearly in a yep. good place. So that's two silver. Yep. 
for a pitcher. Two silver down, cool. Yep. Uh, for the pitcher. Um, well, I'll get uh, at least... No, I'll get three pitchers of this wine. Cool. Uh, just because, you know, that's what was brought to the table earlier. Cause that'll put your the gear has gone up in Thea's estimations. It will go to three silver, is what you change your silver value Thank to. Thank you. Sorted. I'm literally trying to use my fingers right now to count that. It's okay, don't worry, gotcha. you. There you go, sorted. So you get yourself three Cheers, pitchers and six bowls of soup. And um, the waiter and Moira, who we have now discovered her name, um, help you over with the stuff. Mm. They're most kind. Thank you. Thank you for your assistance. She kind of just looks at the table, at everyone, and it's just like that glance of, like, Thea sat down with it, like, pretty sloshed, um, like, red-faced, so it just looks like a bunch of randos are mm. getting her drunk. And then uh, you've got this turtle with a fantastic multicolour changing cloak, who, it's in my head, kids. you're... It's definitely not stopped, it's, it's, it's just constant. In my head, you're wearing a crown, which you're not in the game, but in my head I can't shake that image. <laughs> just thinks so highly of me. It's um, I think it's just the image oh, is just better suited with like a crown. Um, is it a cardboard uh, one from Burger King? Yeah. That used to give kids. <laughs> and other fast food chains also exist, but uh, if Burger King want to sponsor us, I'm very open to an arrangement. Um, I am too up for that. Oh, yes. Whopper of a session. Yeah. Right. <laughs> wow. <laughs> uh, yes. Wow. R Richter von Rune, the king of burgers, was. Uh... <laughs> oh, God, Do I need tough. to add that into his name as well? <laughs> Jesus! Uh, it's the almost as bad as Alvin's of... name. The <laughs> king of burgers. So, regardless, <laughs> you get back to the table. She does that kind of look. Moira looks over the table and is like, en Enjoy! Uh, looks at flea bite on the table. Is like. Okay. Turn you. And uh, like uses like the cloth that she pulls off of the waiter because that's obviously she gave him that cloth. Uh, mm -hmm. She like scrubs at the moss a bit to get it off, and it all kind of comes loose. She like blows it off the table and it's like, sorry about that. And off she walks. As she like looks across the table, what I'll do is I'll take one of the pictures from Alvin, um, from there, and I'll put my trunk in it, suck of a half of it, and then put my trunk in my mouth and drink it from my trunk. Nice. Mm -hmm. I think then, um, as they're walking away, she uh, again whips uh, the guy on the chest with the, uh, the kind of cloth and is like, see, I told you to do that. <laughs> um, and you just hear him like tutting and shaking his head um, <laughs> as they walk away. <laughs> oh dear. So, Alvin, where have you been this whole time? So, in my head, how that's just played out then is as I've ran in, he's asked that, and I've just been, and like, you know, I'll probably even like, um, so everyone's around the table, right? Yeah. 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 Um, all the the table. round the square. <laughs> <laughs> Flea bites on the table, which is better. So, oh. Is, okay, I'm just assuming it's a rectangle. Nope. So. What, what, why yeah. did nobody yep, yep, look yep. at the screen? <laughs> <laughs> ah, right. Okay, yeah, cool. That's it. Yeah, so... Uh, easier the way to X get. is a spare seat. Right. Whereas the F should be on the table. Yeah, it's because it's that was when it was passed out. Yeah. So, well, it either way, I've came running in, dun, jumped, dun, on, dun, jumped dun. on the table, and just been like, dun, 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 guys, dun, dun. right, no, not doesn't matter where I've been. Need help. Need to come with me. King's in danger. Some thing. Woman. I think she might be a dragon because she made air and fire like warm and to, like I couldn't speak. I, I, just um, I don't know, man. Like maybe. Uh, but no. Sorry. Shit. Off the track. I need your help. Elephant. I need you to break down the door. Everyone else. I need you to come with me and I need help because King's is about to probably get done in. Guards are shit as well. And then I'm just like, <laughs> how long will this take? We just got drinks in, so I yeah. pick up. I have horses big one. in an hour. What? Sorry, I have horses in an hour. I think Laida would pick up the pitcher and uh, the bowl in the other hand, drink some of the soup, and then drink some of the pitcher, and then just sit there and do nothing. Mm -hmm. Guy, guy. 
like guys listen listen we need to go like now and i'm just kind of like gesturing towards the door like does I'm it matter spoon and i'm slowly blowing on it like it's kind of warm well everyone will i'll see if anyone is to look at me um i think you're on that. the table right so i think everything's yep, looking so, at me. I mean, we're you watching see, you mm -hmm. you see that alvin's getting pretty pissed off that no one's listening um and he will smack his uh arcane focus on the table and kaboom oh god oh, for fuck's wait sake. what ever they make a con save oh. uh, god damn it oh god it's good i like it i like it <laughs> i don't i'm not good at con uh, um, open you asshole there. Ah, oh, okay. Well, no. Am I the only one who gets? Ah, oh. <laughs> yeah. oh. Probably good because I would probably be forced, folk, like looking at you. So I'd probably most yeah. of the wave would be forced towards um, you. Everyone's glasses, um, by the one. way. Everyone's glasses and bowls all get like upturned as well by this. Uh huh. Like in the area. So yeah, and there's like a boom noise. A so, couple of the people get like frightened obviously because of how loud that actually I mean, is. Considering I rolled on that one, do I just jump out the window in anticipation to leave? <laughs> nah, you, you take one damage, bro. Yeah, you take oh, one damage. No, no. Same with Thea. I, I take damage. Yeah, yeah you I take do. damage. It's, that's why there's a one with thunder underneath it in the chat. Yep, you, you take one damage. <laughs> yep. I think oh, Thea um, stands up. Um, I think in a reflex like Oh, no, no, no. I don't want this to get, like, too intense. I think it, as a reflex, she'll uh, summon her axe and just be like, you dare! I think um, you, you see Moira running, like, across, like, that, and she, like, does that nice, you know, 70s cop drama, slide across the bonnet, slide across the table, and she just slides over a table that's had a drink spilled over it for, you know, frictionless travel, and she's just like, no, 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 not in here. Nope. She's just starts jetting. So I ain't abandoning this fiddle. She's like pointing to the door. Go. Yeah, but like, see, she told us to go. Come with me now. And like, I'll just kind of like jump down off the table at that point and be like, the, the drink and soup that I had in my hands. Is there anything left of them, or are they gone? I, if there wasn't a glass, it's gone. Okay. But if what it about was the bowl, of soup? Uh, the bowl of soup, I think no, you got a good enough save. I think you were fine. You probably were holding on to it tough enough that yeah. it didn't knock it, yeah. Okay. I think the problem is, like, but Adair you... had, like, the spoon in his hand, and then the bowl yeah. was on the table, so it got smacked into him because of the thunder mm -hmm. wave. Yeah, so... But I'm back. now going to blame Alvin for that last glass of good wine, because I hadn't mm -hmm. noticed it as well uh -huh. yet. Yeah, and the bottles... So I bad. now blame Alvin for that. <laughs> <laughs> in, in that case, I just say, I still haven't finished my suit. And she goes, I don't care. I don't want this place trashed. Leave. Yeah, it got his bard. Pretty much. Thea dissipates the axe. Or... And, um... Oh, God. Yeah, Thea. <laughs> um, the and looks at, at, looks at her and just... Uh... I think she apologizes. She says, I'm... Sorry. Can you... Is... Could you let Horseman off early? She just looks at you. Can you goes... No, because he's going to need to clean this up. Hmm. Could I offer to pay his wage for the day to let him off early so Thea can have her thing with the nice man? I mean, you can give a go if you want, right? Uh, my, my, my friend is terribly upset, it seems. Um, can... Can I perhaps pay the wage he would be getting for the day and maybe a bit for the looks over at Alvin Houston and uh, yes that work? You went to that? She puts her hand out. I assume a gold so what do you do? Is that what you say to her? 
Yeah, with very narrowed eyes, and then I pluck out the gold and pop it on there. She does just like gestures with her fingers when you do that. I do the same thing again. <laughs> she like moves the two coins in her hand, and she's like, "One more for politeness." Well, the, only the polite thing to do, looks at Alvin, and I put another coin there. Yeah, and she looks at the three gold and she goes, I'll tell him to get you outside. She says that to Thea. Now, clear out of here before I lose more customers. Nods at everybody, see. like very like like one and done, then walks away. As, I've, as she's kind of walking away, I'll just run up and say, like, there's no time for outside. The king is going to fucking that well, didn't mean that. The king is going to die. You can swear if you want. There's no rules against. Yeah, swearing. no, I don't, I, Alvin doesn't. Alvin doesn't swear. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Um, okay yeah. So and he, and, he, and he runs behind her and just starts like kind of like trying to push her away, like ee, ee, like you know like a kid would do to like their mum when it's like, "Mom, I'm bored. I want to go." Like that, but just trying to like push her. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You touched me one more time. I uh, stand and up, what? drop my ball on the table, the whole of my quarter staff in front of Alvin, just say, not a good idea. And then I follow Thea out the door. Now, Thea's not out the door yet. Or I'll Thea's not out the door. Whatever she's doing. Like... Well, no, if you, put, if you put your staff in between us, I think Thea would just like turn and walk. Yeah, so Thea heads outside. I guess later you follow after that. Alvin, you're yep. you're in there with a flea bite cognac and a, a dare. Right. So I'm still inside. Yeah, so far, unless you want to leave. No, no, I wasn't sure if with that whole one and the thing, I fell out the window because I made a joke about it. But no, no, I, wasn't sure I said if you I, actually did that. No, I did reply, and you said no, you didn't. I didn't have enough cool. force to do that. Maybe so, if it, um, had, had it been a bigger of, spell, like, yes. Um, had it been Thunder Wave, yes, it was only Thunderclap. Ah, sorry, uh, I've been kicked off Discord three times in the past two it's minutes. It's okay, so... um, Yeah, so while they were in, I just, like, turn around and look at them and go, well, get... Sorry, I thought I was having a power cut there. Just like, well, guys, come on, move it! Move, 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 move! I would look to Fle Fleabite, who I'm assuming is still on the table. Still ticking. Fleabite, after our year and a bit together with uh, the others, do you think that Thea and Lida have a thing starting? Or is this just me? Uh, elf thing. Uh, pale bad boat driver thing. And uh, mammoth thing. Both things. No have things for things. Yeah. I see what you're saying. And I'll yep. tap Fleabite on the shoulder, kind of like, hmm. I'll talk to someone else next time. Have a wager on it. Well, this is hap well, they're chatting. <laughs> have a wager on it, sorry. <laughs> Let's call that. <laughs> um, I, while they're chatting away, I'm going to run up, uh, or kind of, not like, uh, not kind of run up, but um, just kind of walk up, like, you know, stomp up to uh, Adair and just like, kind of like, I mean, where would I, co what? I mean, you're sitting down, right? Uh, yes. Yeah, so I could probably reach around. Yeah, so I just kind of like but jump I'm up. I'm very annoyed at you because you just cost me my second ever hit point. Cool. Well, <laughs> I might cost you one more. <laughs> he will definitely cost you more in the future, so it's <laughs> best yep. to tear that band aid off now. <laughs> but I walk up and I just smack you on the back of the head. I'm going to smack you right back. But I'm very oh pissed God. off at you, so I'd like to roll an actual wee, no. you know. <laughs> but anyway, as you do that, I'll be like, 
There's no bloody time. We need to go. The king is in danger. Do you want this place or not? But I do want to slap him. So, Ryan, what do I yeah. do? I roll? Uh, it's like an unarmed attack, right? So, Unarmed. I'm trying to open my character sheet. Bear what do strength versus... No, strength that... versus concept? Nope, because that's a grapple. An actual attack is an attack. Um, two seconds. I'll mm -hmm. get the... Uh... It should be on... On a hit, deals blah blah blah. Right, so roll a d20 plus your proficiency plus strength. Um, I'd love to, but where'd I find all that on my it's on your sheet. sheet? So on the sheet at the yeah. Let me load up your sheet and we'll get the stats. So top left where your inspiration is, right underneath there is your proficiency bonus. Yes. Okay. Right. So tell me what that number is. Mm -hmm. That's a two. Okay. Then look over to the left. Your strength modifier is right there. Oh yeah, okay. That's minus one. Okay. Yep. So that's one. So it's gonna be a D twenty plus plus one. Right. And I do that via this roller thing, me bobber. Uh D twenty okay. Do I just click the D twenty icon? Plus yeah, sure, that's fine. Two, yeah. three, four, and five. You can click the the D twenty. That just rolls multiple. Oh, uh, okay. Sorry, that's my. That's okay. My yeah. First. So click the um, click the first one. Yep. Oh, right, and it brings up an option. So plus one in there, and then roll. Alvin, what's your AC? Uh, my oh, bugger. Uh, my AC is sixteen. Yeah, I don't do nyout. Yeah. Haha. <laughs> but like, I think maybe you hit him in the chest or something, right? And it's like. You know, you make contact, but it's not damaging, right? It's it's uh -huh. it's like a friend. It's like a challenge to a duel kind of slot. Like a backhand to like, the chest or mm. something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Oi! What the? You just what? Like we that. don't have time. We need to go. You need to tell us not display. You're meant to be an educator. Use your brain, not your. I did tell you, you ignored me and drank soup. Eat soup? Do you drink or eat soup? Both. Mm. <laughs> no, like, it's just that like kind of way I'm like, drink or eat soup? They're, God damn it. You just haven't to explained like, anything. You're out of breath. You're all bedazzled. What part of King in danger, women showed up, might be a dragon. I don't know. We need to go and help him. In also, a noisy bar, sir. I don't know what you're saying. At that point, I just turn around and storm out. <laughs> What's called I will I'm, I'm, I'm like, at this point, in Alvin's mind, he's like, I've told you, let's go. So he's just kind of turned around and ran away. Mm -hmm. It's made zero sense apart from causing me a point of damage. And yeah. What about um, Kodak shall... and Fleabite? Cause I, I get... So you follow him out, but what's the other two doing? I probably lost watching this, but just comment. Not at anyone, but just into the room. As a. Uh, as irritating as this is all been, um, we should probably follow him. He's not going to shut up. The only person left is Fleabite, I think. Um, I think Fleabite would... Um, Cognac said that he placed his bowl that was unspilt back down on the table. I think it was louder. I said that. I said that, yeah. Uh, louder, yeah, that's, that's right. Um, and I think he would try and, like, sleight of hand his ball and Lyoda's ball and take it away. Where are you putting them? Or just, just to pick them up and leave with them? Leave. Well, obviously, with their contents. The, the soup is what I'm <laughs> particularly after. I just didn't know if you were going to just pour it into your bag. Is what I thought you were trying to say there, <laughs> or if you're gonna just try and walk out with both balls without being noticed. Uh, I think for the moment, with both balls, without being noticed. Cool. Is Cognac leaving, or is Cognac? Cognac's leaving. Cool. Um, yeah, you can roll sleight of hand if you want. I think if I had inspiration, I would probably use it. <laughs> yeah, not, not needed, buddy. <laughs> you get outside with two bowls of soup before um, 
everybody else gets outside. So this is before Alvin even comes outside. Um, so yeah, uh, you're obviously storm outside first, and then like Loud is like next to you, um, like running up the side of the alley. Uh, is that guy, obviously the waiter, and he's like, "I got to finish early. Um, are, are you still free? Do you want to meet the king first? Oh, oh. Um. Don't worry, your hair's fine. Uh." And then like, he realizes his hands in his hair, so he, he puts it by his side and then like doesn't know where to put them. So he's like, does he put them in his pockets? He doesn't know. And then uh, he's like, but I, I need I need to check on the horses. Um, if I check on them early enough, I'm, I've got the rest of the night free. Uh, I was wondering if you'd, you'd maybe wanna maybe help me with them and maybe we could go what? I'm no. I'm now virtually picturing Steve from Stranger Things with the hair and the... Mm. Uh, yeah, he's trying to chat someone up. <laughs> <laughs> but but if you're busy, like, I, I, I mean, that, that that's okay too, I guess. Um, is anyone else outside or is it just, just Laida? And... I'm with you. I, I think if you would turn to Laida and be like, I, I want it, I want, I need, I want horses. Then lead the way. But Callum doesn't want to run off and the horses while we need to go save the king. <laughs> um, do what Thea would do. Yeah, would Thea go off with uh, this waiter to go? The, the problem is, like... In Thea's problem, mind, though? she wants to go. Yeah, she would. She wants to, like, in her mind, she wants to weigh up whether or not horses are a thing. Mm. Like she I would say, interested in. I think Laird would say, I'm sure the king can handle himself. This also, she's plastered, so... Yeah. Ah, fuck. Okay, yes. She's going to go do horses. She's going to go... Do horses? <laughs> no. Who? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. So you're gonna go with the waiter. I'm gonna go horse horsing. Mm-hmm. Can I start to follow? Uh, yeah. Like, Thea, do you see anything? The fact that Loud is following. No. In her mind, it's literally just she wants to know whether she wants to decide whether or not she likes horses. So she's gonna see horses. This is the start of the Thea spin-off series with Billy Barnum. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, um. <laughs> As you take a couple of steps and like Loud is falling, he's like, I was kind of hoping that it would just be me and you. And he kind of like, his eyes clearly indicate he's talking about Loud. Oh, he, he only oh. says that to you. Thea. I think she turns around and he to looks, Loud and He says, looks kind of like super embarrassed as well about it. No, no, I think she'll turn around to Loud and say, Maybe the horses are scared of elephants. I will bat <laughs> shape into a horse, a riding horse. <laughs> Uh, you can't. You don't have any wild sheep left. Do I not? I nope. thought I have one on my sheep. Nope, you've used two. When? Uh, whatever it was before the panther and the panther. Oh, you were a fox and then a panther. You were a fox. Yep. Fucking god damn it! <laughs> yep. In character. <laughs> <laughs> Just down there in the street. <laughs> yeah, you... Because, uh, yeah, no, we had a short rest. I don't think you get... Do you get wild shape back in a short rest? I do, yeah. Oh, do you? Yeah. Did we have a short rest at the... At the sales? Um, yeah, at the sales. Yeah, that was after no, the At the fox. sales. No, you will, you'll have one then. Yeah, you've got one use. Yeah, because that would be the panther yes. after that. Yeah. I mean, wild shape into a riding horse. <laughs> yeah, you do. To see if Thea likes horses after a year and a bit together, and I've never mm. been a horse before. Thea, how'd you react? Huh? I should look at Horseman. Which one? Being the barman, not Lyda. Mm-hmm. Think of a wee nay. Maybe he's scared of you. 
a uh, sort of. Who do you say that to? Sorry, Theo. Lyoda. Like I would sort of go down and like the horse's like front knees, mm -hmm. and bow my head in front of him. And he um, awkwardly just turns to Theo and says. I have to go feed the horses. Um, I'm sorry I, I bothered you, miss. And he just turns and walks away. She struck out. I think Theo will scratch her head. And be like, huh. If a horse can frown <laughs> and look confused. I think it can. Why not? Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, that Theo would just like walk, like I guess, kind of maybe power walk back to to where everyone else is. <laughs> so just like okay. uh, like two meters away, right? Like yeah, you know, it's just six like feet away. very confused. We're, we're looking out the window, watching this. Well, you have all left by this point, and maybe you are all outside. And this is down the side alley, so yeah, you have all uh, <laughs> left by this point. These are probably all just watching Theo stand next to a horse and the back of this guy walking away. I think Could she'd I... like walk past and be like, "Horse, horseman's yeah. <laughs> wants horses," Could and just I walk. Nudge the uh, with my nose and then sort of like shake my head backwards, sort of trying to signal. Do you want to go for a ride? I don't know how you could signal that by nudging. Um... Like a nudge, and then like, you know how like you're like telling somebody to come here with your head. Like oh, that, okay, uh, yeah, like gesturing back the way. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I don't know if Theo would immediately think, go for a ride, considering <laughs> she didn't know what a horse was seconds ago. <laughs> so she knew what horses were. She was just undecided whether or not she liked them. Mm. Um, and I like bend down slightly. Praising. I, 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 like, I, I feel like I need to... I'm, I'm trying to... I'm finding it difficult to go like, ah, Theo would understand that. I feel like maybe... Uh, I don't know. E either rolling something or just ignoring it. <laughs> it's up to you. You could roll insight or you could just ignore it. Uh, I'll roll insight uh, because I'm I'm undecided. I don't think you get it. <laughs> no. Okay, like, I don't know, maybe as you like kind of nod your head back, I think she looks at the guy walking away. Yeah, I was going to say, because you definitely, it was, you don't really need, it was too, too unsubtle. To really need to roll insight for the guy's intention. It was clearly I wanted to spend some time alone with you. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and I, th I, you know, I think maybe Thea would take that as Lyuda going away. Go, go see, go see Horseman. Mm -hmm. I don't want to leave you alone. Last time it didn't go well. And uh, yeah, Thea. So also... She won't be alone. Oh. And then. Go and um, yeah, she would just just kind of like walk, like follow the, the 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 barman, but not not like run after him, but like follow him at a pace that she could like see where he's going, and then maybe when he like got to where he was going, then show up. Yeah, the horse eyes. What's <laughs> uh, everybody else doing? Um, I'm getting ready to follow Alvin to. Alvin, where are you off to then? Cause the like, library. Like a... I am. I'm just storming back to the gate. Cool. So the Alvin, castle. Adair, um, you're you're following. Adair is following Alvin. Yeah. What, flea bite and cognac. I'm following Adair. Cool. Flea bite, you're eating some soup, I assume. Um, I take like a slurp of soup, putting my entire face into the bowl. <laughs> um, take a take a big slurp and then immediately vomit a load of it back up onto the street. <laughs> what? This soup has no... Or, uh, this swill has no um, meat meat. Why no people in... Yup. Um, and I this think... is maybe what Lyoda here is um, as a horse. As everyday, like, <laughs> single file marches down the street after Felipe just throws up on the street. Lyoda will sort of look back Sort of sad at Theo walking away. Um, then notice uh, Flea Bite do this and walk up to him, nudge him, do the same signal to uh, what I did with Theo, see if he wants to ride. Uh, Flea Bite would then finish both um, both soup bowls and um, put them in his pack and 
I'm gonna get some puke in my head, aren't I? No, no. I, I was just Fleabag was disgusted that it didn't have yeah. people in it, but he's still not gonna waste all. Of it. I give a little sort of what's it called a whinny when they sort yeah. of go up in their hind legs a bit and then do a short gallop to catch up and then sort of trot along with people. Yeah, excellent. So there we go. We have it. Um, right. You guys all get to the guardhouse after a bit of time, yeah? It's made me really hungry. Do I show them quick ways to get to the guardhouse? I mean, from the back of a horse and they're all in front of you? I mean, it depends. Are you he's gonna, on the horse, he are you, probably are you gonna tell the Are you going to tell the horse to move faster, or what? I would be, um, if you'll permit. Yeah, what? <laughs> It's not um, that, that's how I imagine Fleabite just like on the front of the horse, like, <laughs> on its on its head, like pointing which way to go. Trot, trot, trot. Yeah, that way, under there, through this side, that street. I think the problem right. Fleabite is going to have is that a lot of these places aren't horse accessible. Mm. Well, I love that this is literally where Lauda has been, so Lauda knows where he's going. Isn't mm. it? I mean, you've all been to the gatehouse. Yeah. Yeah. So, Flaybite doesn't need to dig it. Uh, yeah, but he might know a quicker way to get there than we do. That's his whole, like. And, and they can that. lead to companions. I thought, I thought he went epically bad with his previous thing, where he parkoured like crazy. And, the climbing was bad. Fat, yeah, yeah, the climbing was bad, but the rest was fine. Um, well, okay. <laughs> But yeah, I mean, Fleabite can try and direct, but I want to hear Fleabite direct then. Uh, yes, yes. Um, um, skitter jump over that uh, apple cart. Now, um, uh, very quick. Uh, uh, skitter leap towards the next street. And hard uh, left paw that way. So like, I guess past the group of you, including Alvin, there's a horse <laughs> with a rat on its head. <laughs> Galloping path. Uh, in uh, in my mind, oh, it's, you know, like rally drivers, how they have like the the navigator next to them, and they're like hard right, two hundred meters. <laughs> <laughs> is, is that sort of thing? But with yeah. I think when when I first hear the instructions and I hear his enthusiasm, uh, I'm like hell yeah, and I like I kick my back feet, like one of my back feet, just sort of like revving up, and then I just gun it down the street, following his directions, jumping over carts, whatever he. Or whatever else. Um, Just I'm keep keeping it there. Mm -hmm. I'm keeping close to Alvin because he's the one who mm. did all this. Yep, Alvin. Charging on. Um, just. Not even looking back. Just I'm. I'm just at this point assuming everyone's following me. So I'm just. I mean, a horse hit. has run past you with a rat on its head. You so. don't know where we're going. Yeah. Um. To the, yeah. the thingy, the castle. Mm -hmm. So, yep, just charging onto the castle. Yep. Again. For for extra flavor, could I just also be doing um, the uh, silent images as like a, a map and like direction arrows? <laughs> uh, sure. Why not? Yeah. Um. You just have a big arrow floating above us that turns as we as we go. <laughs> <laughs> and it changes colour as to how sharp the corner is. Yeah, it's like a like Forza with the little lines in it. <laughs> <laughs> that or it's just a bigger, more impressive rat pointing the way when you get to certain like checkpoints in the road. Um, it's just a rat flat, pointing. Yes, yes. <laughs> Sadly it's a silent image though, but yeah. Um, so Ryan, that's me. What time of the day, roughly, would we think it is if our dinner with the king is at seven? It's probably late afternoon. Afternoon, -ish. so we do have time to think about for a wee while. Yeah, I mean, see us off on <laughs> a date. Not <laughs> <in danger. laughs> we're sprinting towards the castle and the king right now. Yeah, and technically, it's just we were meant to be at the villa, so I was like. Do we need to split the party so someone's at least at the villa? But no, if there's plenty of time to get back to the villa and time for the yeah, because if you assume game, evenings yes. like seven or eight, right? Mm -hmm. If you assume evenings okay. seven or eight, then yeah, th there is still at least like f what four hours at least 
um, before. Cool, plenty of time. Sure. No, I just wanted to check in case. I mean, who knows? We go to this place, we end up in a whole shenanigan moment. Mm -hmm. We might mm -hmm. miss the meeting with the king, and I don't think any of us want that. So, mm -hmm. I mean, Theo's been mm -hmm. off on a date with the barman, so like this is true. Yeah, I uh, him. Yeah, so so we're already a member down. <laughs> Flee by and uh, Lyuda get to the guardhouse first. Um, so what do you do? When you get there. No living there. says there is danger. Yes, and um, a attack from behind kill to a uh, big clan leader with metal. Louder. I'm still a horse. You are indeed. So <laughs> you do outside the uh, gatehouse. I just sort of stand there looking proud and letting my. Um, Ryder do all the talking. Just enjoying oh, being God. a horse. I mean, he's, drunk. He's, he's talking to you currently, so yeah. Oh, I, I thought there was like a guard there. No, no. It's like, as I described for Alvin, there's right. nobody outside. Ah, uh, okay. Nope. Oh, I, I still just say it to no one then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so do you just wait outside or do you just go in? I mean, the gate's. Is there a gate? There's doors into the the gatehouse, yes. Big, huge doors. Remember Alvin doors pushed them open? Yeah, easily. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I guess I just nudge the door open with my head and walk in. Yep, and a flea bite. Yeah, yeah, I'd stay just like sitting on the head of the horse. Yeah, and a, as you like nudge the doors open, two of the guards approach from inside and they say, your horse will have to wait outside. Mm. Horse? What? What an old um, horse thing? This is mammoth thing in funny form. <laughs> you will here to help help. You have clan leader in danger, yes. Clarify. Receive direction for um, from uh, dwarf gnome thing that uh, leader attacked by um, dragon beast. Yes. Your information appears to be outdated. Please remove your horse, or it shall be removed. Would guard remove uh, human thing because it is also thing? Clarify. Yeah, you racist. This is uh, this is mammoth thing, and it is the same as uh, human thing. Would you remo remove human thing just because it is human thing? You have been asked to remove your horse. What is horse? And then, like the like the metal hand just points at Lauda, who is a horse. Fina <laughs> <laughs> doesn't know that. <laughs> what is horse? <laughs> I think by this point, uh, others kind of caught up by now. Um, so you see the back end of a horse hanging out of double doors into the gatehouse. Okay. Do we know this as uh, Lyoda? I mean, Look. I don't know. You've not seen a Lyoda. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean, I feel like... But we saw her ride off with Fleabite. Oh, you saw a Fleabite ride off on a horse. But we would assume that's Lyoda. Then, then assume Lyoda away? <laughs> 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 uh, okay. Mm. I think we can't get in. Yeah, it's big enough for you to go in the site. Like the, there's two big double doors. Um, All right. It's just when you said Lyra's the horse. I just said this ass was there. Yeah, it's still hanging out the doorway, but it doesn't see you can't get in. Like, okay. If I had um, to doodle, right? Like, if this was for some reason <laughs> the guardhouse, right? There's just like a big door like that. 
I'm like, how are you going to draw this horse's ass? And like, stairs, <laughs> stairs. <gonna come. laughs> and then... Uh, horse. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Just definitely more PC than I did on it. Nice. There you go. It's the back end of a horse. Is that flea bite at all? <laughs> That's actually very well done. That's I really good, see. actually. Yeah. Let's go. See? Who knew my one scale drawing rats on the back of the head was the back side of a horse? It's halfway the door. Um, I totally see that as being what it is. Yeah. Lovely. Let's go. Um, I look to the others to see what they do. <laughs> Alvin? Um, um, yeah, so as I've kind of caught up to the door and, like, you know, went in, I'll be like... Right, now, let us in. We're going to go and save the king, because you aren't. Who are you saying that to? Because literally they're halfway through the door with. No, he's walked what? past. What? He's no. walked in, and yeah. uh, he's asking the I've guards walked. this. Oh, he's gone all the way. Sorry, so I thought you were. The guard the turns door. from the guard turns from Fleabite and looks at uh, Alvin and says, "You have returned. There is still, as yet, no response. You are still free to wait." And it motions towards the seating area. There'll yeah. be no response because everyone will be destroyed. Clarify. I warned you before. The the, the lady, she, she was here. You conked out and get her for some reason. I couldn't speak. Air was warm. I think she's a dragon. Most definitely a dragon. The, the air wasn't warm, be... like no yeah. warmer than normal. It was just the effect of like heat rippling, but there was no heat. Oh, right. Okay. Sorry. I thought that no, that's okay. it was, right. Um, you know, and uh, sorry, where was I? Um, so I, I'd lost my train of thought and, you know, she was probably, can dragons be, you know, damn, another thing. Look, there was a person in the castle who you didn't let in. We want to go up to stop them because you aren't. I'm afraid they'll be quite useless, my dear. And you hear a voice coming from behind of the guard. And uh, there's like a rippling of, again, the air. And I'll be like, like, who who would be beside me the now then? So I mean, to, uh, your, <laughs> to your left, there is Fleabite <laughs> on a horse that is Lauda. Oh wait! So is flea bite still on the horse? Well, yeah. Like I'd be like I'd be like tapping Lauda's like front leg, just being like, "Look, told you, told you." Probably yeah, dragon enough. lady. Okay. Probably be tapping his like knee, given mm -hmm. your stature. Yeah. Yeah, like you know, uh, you know, just tapping at you just to kind of give you and like to mm -hmm. basically go, "Look, look, look! Told you, told you." Possible dragon lady. You hit and, my reflex and I accidentally kick you. And, uh, <laughs> so yeah, he, he's gonna see this woman in kind of like, you know, almost like red kind of wrapped robes um, around her, almost just like in a fine lace, like layered up, um, slightly kind of wildish hair about her, um, and she just smiles down at Alvin uh, and waves. Hello again. No, that's good. Hi. So, uh, what's your script? Yeah, turn to I speak many script. And I'll be like, hmm. Alvin isn't Scottish. Hmm. <laughs> what are you doing here? Who are you? Are you a dragon? A dragon? Do I look that bad? Is my skin that dry today? And she just kind of like heartily laughs, sticking there herself. Um, and the laugh fills the room more than it probably should. Hmm. She says, no, but I believe you read my son's book today. And that's where we end that session. What you prick! Oh, nice. Oh. However, oh. there's a tiny, there's a tiny, tiny epilogue here where we zoom all the way over to the countryside, where we've got a uh, this a uh, this waiter man walking with a, uh, you know, see how you catch up to him. Um, do you say anything to him I'm like when you catch up? 
Um, so, uh, is he looking at the horses? Have we no, he's like, the he's, he's at the point where he's like, he's climbed over a bit of fence, right? Like a kind of stepped fence. Um, and as oh, he's like, okay, yeah, as yeah. he stepped over, he's noticed that you are only a couple of steps behind. Um, and he's like, oh, you, you change your mind? I think she would just, um, uh, like she, she's put her intrigue mask on and just looks at him and goes, Horses, <laughs> and then uh, he like steps up on his side of the fence and offers you a hand to get you over the, the other side. She takes it, and then uh, as he's like, he jumps down from his side and helps you down the steps. And uh, he says, "My name's Haranin, by the way," and he kind of just like smiles really bashfully with his red cheeks. <whistles> and that's it. I'm happy to fade out on that. So, yeah. Uh, that was hero. What does uh, folks want to call this session? Dark side of the mirror. No, amazing horses ass drawing. No. Um, I mean, you've got that one on you. <laughs> who knew that was one of my skills, eh? Um, but yeah, so what are the thoughts? Um, There's so many. There are, <laughs> there in are fact, many. so goddamn many. Um, um, I so, had a hickory dickory dock. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> so the one I'm going to go with sounds like a clock. The one that I am going to suggest, at least, is actually the Book of Von Rune because it's the one I said last mm -hmm. session that I said doesn't actually apply this week, um, but might apply next week. So if anybody else has got, if quite quite yeah, important plot. <laughs> but feel free to volley in more suggestions. Um, I mean, mm -hmm. I guess the. The absent fiddle have, like, is also the bar, the, the tavern name. That's so be a lot of it was the, yeah. <laughs> the bar. So. Did dine? Yep. I feel like that would have worked better if um if, we actually wine, dine and if we'd shine. actually gone for dinner with the king. <laughs> um, wine, dine, and shine. <laughs> what was it? A deer said, "I'm not that kind of rogue." <laughs> 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 I'm just not that kind of rogue. Oh. Get it because it's like a round of drinks and applause because of your thunder clap. I see what you did there. <laughs> um, stretch. Like That's the second time Alvin's done damage thunder clapping me. And puns. <laughs> We've also got uh, like tears in the wine because who doesn't love a good, uh, you know, reference? Oh, teary rag cloth, yeah. Uh, um, mm. But yeah, I don't know. What do you like? I'm going to put my vote because obviously. I'd, let's speed this part up. What do you want? Unless you've got any other I'm good with the Book of One, Ryan. I'm, um, yeah. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm going to be that, that deck that does his own. Because I'm, I'm, I'm really proud of that. <laughs> and you'd be proud, Scotty. Oh, crap. I don't know about you. Oh, heck. Ah. There we go. Got it. <laughs> do oh, I have the distracting have... vote? Yes, you do. Is that... <laughs> yep. <laughs> well, it's between three of them. Mm-hmm. So, come on, Thea. Uh, uh, do you know what? Do you know what? Melon. Yay! <laughs> there we go. Melon. Melon. Um, good. Which one did I vote on? I thought I did the Book of you Von did. Did. Rune. Oh, cool. I thought my wee thing's Wait. not there. <laughs> <laughs> now it's confusing, because... The dares reacted to two of them. Did I? How? You reacted to my one as well. To um, the tears in the wine. Yeah, that's, why it's, it's, uh, that's what I thought. I don't know why that happened. Sorry. I'm... Eating! <laughs> well, it feels like we've got a lot of votes for uh, one of them. Um, yeah. I wonder why that one, could be. That's the one that I meant to vote <laughs> on, but for some the reason. The person that didn't vote for either of those two, I'll vote for uh, the Book of Von Okay. I've never seen such controversial in naming session. Like, <laughs> oh dear. Um, I would demand a recount. Um, right, okay, so <laughs> no, the, no, no, no. The book of Von Run for now. Um, excellent. Let us uh, talk about goals. Who thinks they've completed the goal? Goals. Not, uh, not quite yet. I don't know. I need to ask Thea. Mm -hmm. 
So uh, um, let's have a look. So Adair, you said you don't think so. Alvin? I would say I have. Okay. Because it was learn if Runestad is slash was working on similar portal research as Starling. Now, the book confirmed that they were, and it confirmed that the king was researching it as well. Yep, 100%. With Starling. Mm -hmm. So I would consider that goal complete. So I never said with Starling, just also researching it. Um, mm -hmm. Starling did come here. She was there. Yeah, yeah, yeah sorry. Yeah. You know, you know but I mean. yeah, no, yeah, I'd say you've completed that, yeah. So Yay. let's just keep a tracker of this without editing our sheets so far then, right? So that's what... Yours are all level three, right? Yep. So yes, that's currently three hundred XP. Let's not add it just yet. A uh, Cognac, we're maybe a a bit away from that goal. Um, <clears throat> a few hours, you'd say. Yeah, um, or perhaps maybe saving him. You need to provide dinner to make sure the goal is qualifiable. He <laughs> could be dying, and I could bring in. The soup. <laughs> Look, it's impressive, isn't it? Ah, oh, he's gone. Yeah. <laughs> oh well. I was a. I was just put the bowl of soup next to him. He, he, he went the way he lived. Just he, tell everyone his dying words were, "Wow, Cognac's soup was amazing." Um, <laughs> turtle soup. Yeah. Uh, right, flea bite. I think we're still working on that one too. Still working. Yep. Uh, Lauda does need to wait on a uh, Sia. Uh, this, this is true. So I see ya. I, I don't think it's complete, but the, I think there was some progress made, you know, shared over a a beverage. I, w I definitely feel like there was better okay. progress made in this session than the last one, because it felt more like... I think um, I think because Lyuda's kind of dropped the sort of... Um, Pretension? The sort of pa pretentious pandering to... To Thea and the, you know the sort of like um, yeah, it's just almost came, it's became enabling now, which is also what Thea's into. So yes, yeah. um, you know because like before La Laoda was literally just going, just agreeing with Thea for the sake of agreeing with Thea. Where it seems more now that Laoda is actually like kind of concerned with what Thea's thinking. Mm -hmm. So I think definitely there has been some like good steps forward. Um, I wouldn't say it's complete, but it's. It's definitely like mm. yeah, I'd agree. a good way to come so like maybe yeah. like if that continues for like another session maybe there's definitely been a chance it's complete depending on the outcome of said interactions yeah yeah by all means yeah cool cool and then i think that's like within a session's worth of rp to yeah i'd say if we had like the same level of detail as like the session again like i'd say that seems to me fair I... yeah i'd say so what about just waiting for Aiden them to ruin it next week. <laughs> <laughs> just, but Tia just got right out at that point and just goes and lives with a Haranin. Um, <laughs> it's uh, a love story. Uh, we need him in the NPC list. See ya. Uh, I'm going to ask Haranin now to get out of me. <laughs> get some <laughs> Um. Yeah, think. no, I've, I've, I've not, I'm definitely not complete, but um, mm -hmm. I think it's definitely something that I want to get done. So, okay. Um, does MD have any goals they wish to slot in now, or is everything good? Like Alvin, not you're, break you're, her Anin's heart. Alvin, you're blank just now. So, do you have anything in mind? Nothing in mind just now. Um, I'll sit and have a right good think and get back to you. Oh, good, okay. So, go sed seduce the queen. <laughs> you can do that, dude. I have faith. I'm not a bard. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to be a bard. But have faith in you. Go and do my. You've been bard. And... <laughs> <laughs> uh, does everybody want to add that XP? Then that's that's three hundred XP. Everybody gets to add. Um, Two five zero zero. Yep, I've added it for you, dear. Thank you, dude. Because. You're welcome. I'm I'm actually operating on a tablet what? more than I am the laptop. That's okay. What are we at, what are we at now? Twenty five hundred. Like, uh, yeah, but how far is that off? Is that <coughs> three hundred like off? Three hundred off, yeah. Okay. What think of a really easy goal we can complete. I mean it's only like two hundred off, is it not? Yeah, yeah two hundred. 
to the I had chat. my fingers um, crossed when Callum was talking about my relationship. Mm-hmm. I know, Sorry. Right? <laughs> it was one of those things where, like, me as Callum would be like, oh, yeah, yeah, it's fine. Yeah, let's level up. But, no, um, I completely no, agree I, I don't. I don't want to just... I do agree it was Ryan, much better progress, this one, though. Yes, I do. <laughs> we're nearly there, and I'm going to apologize. No, that's fine. You if you, have, what's gonna you happen have to go, you have to go. But I level up. Oh, okay. no, no. Oh, God, level up. oh, yeah, don't worry. We'll deal with that as and when. Oh, God. You, you know what yeah, I'm planning, the other stones. <laughs> I know, it's fine. Oh, God. That's, that's, that's our <laughs> That headache. sounds awful. I don't want to know. Um, Adair, do you want to start us off then with a wrap-up chat? Um, tonight has been awesome. Uh, we got some drinks down. Uh, we learned Lyoda can handle his drink after 300 yeah, odd years. Yeah, right. Uh, so that's good. Uh, next time, a couple of like, vodka shots and whatnot. Mm-hmm. Um, um, I do... Actually, yeah, that's a good Kinda point. Concerned. Bonds are a good thing. Mm-hmm. Does MD, sorry to just step into this, does MD think any bonds oh, right. have come up? 100% agree there. Why that was me that skipped that. Oh, that's a good point, actually. Um, uh, let's do it in order, first of all, though. Uh, there, uh, any bonds come up? Uh, let me just check. Um, not really in my part. How that feel? Uh, going to need to have a think about it, but from the ones that I've got, nothing came up so far. Okay, Cognac. Yes, but not in a good way. Okay. Uh, uh, mine with Lauda came up, where I respected Lauda for helping me with alcoholism, and then I realised he spent a lot of my money getting a bit of wine. Yeah, very fine. Yeah. Didn't even offer me any. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I gave you the rest of the bottle after I asked for it. Yeah. yeah, I was going to say, was that the empty bottle that I was meant to have to? Some of? You know, it's the very last glass as well. So, so how do you I want to didn't... change that as the relationship? Then is that can be thought maybe Lloyd isn't the best person for your sobriety? I am. Um... No, it's definitely that I'm upset and disappointed in him. Um. Oh, that's worse than being right. annoyed. Right. So I'm, I'm here's the thing, right? You. Had that came up in the session. I'd have given you inspiration for that, right? But because you didn't actually act upset with yeah. Lauda, that's why I'm not. Does it make sense? But feel yeah, free to change um, that bond I, with I, Lauda. I don't think it, yeah, I agree with you totally there. It was more that I wanted to change it to Yeah, that. no, that's fine. Yeah, 100%. But this is what I'm saying. Like, I want to give you tips on how to get the most yeah. out of these as you write them and whatnot. So feel free to rewrite that with how you feel that is. I'll come back to you. Uh, anything else come up for you, though, Cognac? Or is that... Everything. Contact. That is everything. Cool. Flee back. Um, I would sort of say my own with Thea came up. Uh, yeah, I think so. I think I, I slightly got to her a little bit with mm-hmm. mockery. Which sort of... I'd say so. Um... Oh, yes. How do you want to adjust that, though? I said, how do you wish to adjust that particular uh, goal, that bond, as it were? Yeah, <laughs> insert. Okay, but yeah, you can uh, sc- like mark it off and uh, mark inspiration for yourself there. Lauda. I think two of mine came up today. Okay. The first one being the one with Sia. That Lauda's finding an equilibrium um, with Sia's chaos and his order is moving... Uh, more towards the chaotic side and loosening up. Yeah, I, think yeah, I can see that. Like, yeah, I can see that. Oh. Um, and what else? There's still some work to convince Thea to come a bit his way as well. But. Yeah, I'd say that you're definitely working towards Thea, but Thea, mm. I wouldn't say he's moved towards you yet. Maybe if you can pull Thea from, let's torch the city down to something slightly more reasonable, mm-hmm. maybe we can. Uh, but yeah, feel yeah. free to like update that if you wish. Um, what was the other one? Thea now thinks. Two seconds. Thea now thinks that Leah Ed, and Thea have a little relationship bonding. Leia and Thea. Lauda and Thea, yeah. Um, <laughs> Lyuda, yeah, sorry. It's okay. So, Lauda, yes. your other bond. Lauda. Is the one with flea bite. Um, as soon as Thea walked away, um, Lauda turned straight to flea bite. He was in a wild shape and wanted to work together. He knew that Fleabag would be into it. 
Uh, I don't know if I would say you scouted for the group, right? I feel like he's just ran off from the group. I didn't scout, no, specifically. So, yeah, I don't, I, I wouldn't say that come up, but you could probably change it to be more effective or more broad, right? Mm -hmm. But you can definitely get inspiration if you don't already have it for the Theon. Um, cool. Because I've definitely seen active work on that. And Thea? Um, I think definitely, um, hold on, there we go. Uh, Flea Bite came up. Um, Flea Bite is pushing all the right buttons at all the wrong times. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Very much so. Um, but and I, I, I guess that's your bond. Like that's kind of Flea Bite's bond to you. Right? Yes. Like so, what do you intend to act upon that? If that makes sense. Because okay, yeah. Um, for example, I guess... you've got loaders with Cognac, which is I want to support Cognac in battle. That isn't, you know, that isn't say Cognac needs. Support in battle, if that makes sense. Even though that's still a valid. Uh -huh. um, I think I think it's. Um, I don't want to say flea bites heading for a smack, but I mean it feels like you're saying that flea though. bites heading for a smack, which is basically how I've updated mine. <laughs> yeah. Uh, right. Okay. Have you updated yours then? Yeah. Uh, 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 heading for a smack. Can't spell, but that's okay. Oh, I suddenly feel like I should address Fleabite's drug problem. Sure, because um, currently it's helped Fleabite with his gambling issue. So do you think it's just gambling and drugs <laughs> issue? Gambling. Uh, I kind of like. I mean, I should. Oh, sorry, I've closed my Google down. Um, it's okay. What, what was the thoughts? My, um, what. My bond with Fleabite, I don't believe I actually have one at the moment. It says help Fleabite with his gambling issue. Does it? Right. Because yes. um, he kept saying, drug it, he kept saying uh, wager. He wanted to, yeah, wager. What well, just right? I, add in and drugs. And mm, drug issue. And snorting issue, because we're not necessarily saying it was a drug. Mm -hmm. It's just he wanted... I've added it in for that. you, so hopefully it with the gambling cool. and snorting issue. Uh, any other <laughs> any other that, changes for that these? That works Bonds, no, all good. Um, oh, the actually, I'm going to oh, oh, ha hello, everybody. A little bit of. Okay, so let's get Louder yeah, because Louder like, spoke first. Okay, yeah. Uh, so I've just changed it to uh, using Wild Shaper work with Flea Bite, and I let out my my fun side. Uh, sure, yeah, I think that works. Because yeah. every time I seem to go with. Um, <clears throat> Flea bite, like when we were doing foxes and stuff, we we're playing around. We got distracted from actually doing the scouting, and we just had a bit of fun. And again, with uh, turning into a horse, just galloping down the street, not giving a shit about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh... You gotta be more focused. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I was just gonna say, change like the first part of Lauda's from Lauda's pandering and patronizing manners and fury thing to Lauda's slowly becoming more um, understanding and. Uh, well, I don't really have an end. <laughs> uh, more understanding and tolerable, um, and then keep the the last part because that's. So what does just it slowly entirely? becoming showing more of the chaotic side. So what have you worded it as? Uh, Lauda's uh, slowly becoming more understanding and tolerable. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, it works. Definitely. Um, any other bonds before we wrap up for the wrap up chat? Andy, no, going once. Going twice, bonded. Cool. Uh, Adir, back to you. Sorry about the interruption earlier. I wrap up chat. No, you're absolutely fine. Um, I unfortunately, I think Google's frozen is frozen again for me. But you updated yep. uh, me and Fleabite. Thea, I feel like my bond should be trying to help her repair her mass because you know what I was saying. Like, hey. We can fix that wee crack with some candle wax and mm -hmm. blah, blah, blah. I mean, I don't realise what mm. she sees in these masks. I saw a simple break where you could fix it like this. Mm -hmm. Because that's the kind of knowledge I'll add I that in. have. I um, helped Thea repair We did mention this last week, didn't we? And then Callum said, I don't know if Thea would want it to be fixed. Yeah, but like, it doesn't mean to say that Adair won't pursue that, though. Yeah. Right? Yeah, um, it's like, 
do you know with a wee bit of uh, wax and blah 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 you could then, maybe buff that out because keep in mind you and that might lead to them actually talking about why she doesn't want it fixed right yeah, which is good mm -hmm. um, that's the whole point of bonds is to pursue our yeah and um, so yeah. i've put in there helps you repair her mask um for you as well Excellent. next time when i say bonds going once twice and i guess we're done like that's the cue to jump in by the way <laughs> <laughs> um, um but yes wrap up chat please <laughs> oh dear. Uh, but yes, um, tonight was awesome. Uh, we got to drink some. Uh, we saw a giant elephant actually inhale through his nose, but squirt it into his mouth. Mm -hmm. They don't drink through the nose. Uh, so I think everyone learned something. Um, we, yeah, I had fun. Good. I'm glad. Um... I still am concerned why the flea bite ticks, but you know, we'll get better. <laughs> a secondary problem. Um, we have so many more important problems, trust me. We have a lot of important problems to deal with that we're just ignoring, just, but that's okay. So when, yeah. when you slide your unconscious person under a table and they start ticking, that, that's kind of a thing for me. Nothing like their own personal cutscene that's more disturbing either the way, but yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> but, um, Alvin. Yes? <laughs> <laughs> Your thoughts on the session? Yep, I have those. Good. <laughs> <He's> uh, <lying. laughs> like, book was fun. I, I I wasn't expecting to, you know, go into a book. That doesn't often happen, no. No, it does not. So I was, uh, you know, you've also been added quite... to the book as well. Remember? Yeah, I am book. You know, it's fucking awesome. Mm. Um, name. <laughs> is this book? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, um, I really like the whole thing as well, where I was just like showed up at bar. Yo, guys, King's under attack, and everyone's like, "They're not give a fuck." We, but we've got soup. I think was the uh, response. It's like, I think soup is more important than King. I'm like, but, but, um. Um, like, fuck, how can I get their attention? Like, what would I do to be like, right? How the fuck can I just be like, ever? I'm like, I know, Thunderclap! <laughs> that was good. I liked it. Um, yeah, uh, I, 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 I enjoyed it thoroughly. And it'll be good to see what happens. Mm, definitely, especially the bombshell at the end. Uh, yep. Imagine his name being Haranan the whole time. <laughs> Cognac. You got the NPC list. Big Daddy Cognac is spending a lot of money. Mm. He doesn't seem to be getting any of it back. That's very true. He's uh, still 20 gold in deficit, I think, at the moment as well. There's also the three gold to cover the <laughs> barring situation. The three gold that you were going to pay to let that guy get off early, then Theo was just going to be like, Okay, goodbye. Oh, no, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm cautious of money. <laughs> I, I'm happy for money to create situations, but... Mm -hmm. but uh, cautious of my uh, money. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mm. At least you look fabulous. There's always that. He, I looked he fabulous before, course. darling. I see. I mean, I feel like now, <laughs> now you have the fabulous tag, uh, whereas before you just had grumpy turtle tag. <laughs> because remember, you had the sparkling shield. Yeah. Um, it's just fabulous with a capital F now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, else you wish to add? Uh, I want my money, but that's about it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Worth my money! Flea bite. Um, so I had a lot of fun with that. So I, I love the sort of casual interactions. Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, I, <laughs> it, it was one of those times when having uh, a crit failure was sort of exactly what I wanted to happen. Mm -hmm. um, and the, that whole sequence, um, I cannot wait to try and see how else I can trigger that. <laughs> So I expect a lot of snorting of things. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, and yes, that was fun. And I, 
and I, I just I did really enjoy just that sort of image of um, flea bite like right on the the, the tip of um, Lyoda's horse head, like pointing directions, having like a, a heads up display appear for him and stuff. It's good. Uh, Very good. Yeah, and I also in my mind like absolutely what would just happen when there's unconscious rat on the, the floor or someone just lazily underneath, <laughs> underneath the table. And so I was so happy that someone else also had that thought. It's good. So yeah, a lot of fun. Oh, good. It was nice to hear a bit more flea bite the session again. It's been nice to have more actual interactions, even if you are finding ways to narratively knock yourself out of interacting. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. I, I also do want to sort of try and um, not make him more eloquent, but just um, expand upon more his, his speech more than just being yes, yes. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Yeah, that can definitely happen. My goal of flea bites, if needs be, or just a goal of Alexander's, I guess. Um, <laughs> anything else you want to add? No, as always, great session. Good, good. I, La Uda. So, uh, first off, uh, for those that get the reference, I'm now called La Uda Stonebreaker. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll give you that one. <laughs> other than that, like I actually love that session. That was like my favorite one so far. That was great. Um, I like to think things like um, nudging Thea didn't work, but nudging Fleabite worked because we had that background of scouting together. He knows like my visual signals from being in various um, fox forms and such. But um, also, just love the fact that we're. Being all together, um, we're all part of the scene at the same time. Everybody's getting into it and adding their own stuff. And mm. Lots of um, interesting interactions, and every everybody was had like had their time to shine and had a lot of fun. You're uh, welcome. I also, <laughs> I also really enjoyed that I had to message Ryan halfway through and come up with a backstory for my staff in about 30 seconds. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, am at work. I want to see yeah. this background work now. Nope, nope. Sure you're working. <laughs> None of it. It's all secrets. Secrets of the trade. Um, if you want to look at my secrets, you can subscribe to my highest level Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, that was, that was so much fun. Like, coming from, like, sessions where it's pretty much dungeon crawly, like, not not with you guys, but like from previous campaigns. That you're just that you're just gonna throw no. shade on Sunday no, there, no. and like, oh, okay. No, from <laughs> like uh, sessions I've done previously with different groups, doing very dungeon crawly, of trying to get into the whole role playing thing, and this was like the most fun and most interactive I've had one, and it was great. I think um, Callum can maybe give you a bit of an insight into my RP team, but probably Scott actually as well, because I forget that Scott's been through fifty sessions of the other game with me now. Um, yeah. Um, but yeah, and I'm still alive. But like, my style is definitely I like the narrative to drive the game and not just mm. fights. Yes. Um, yeah, no, I enjoy it a lot more. Um, it's way more. But I wanna kill shit. Killing shit is fun, yeah. But, but it's it's more than just like, oh, uh, you roll dice all day. Which yeah. Is great. Yeah. Because it's not necessarily that you're a weapon, right? You're not a weapon. You're a person yeah. that happens to have the powers beyond some weapons. <laughs> the called? thing is, as well, though, is it does let you think of more creative ways to use your spells yeah. and abilities and stuff yeah i mean i rolled what five dice today mm -hmm. probably the most of every day um, <laughs> yeah i was gonna say <laughs> yeah I think it was pretty much a layer of heavy dice and a lot of that was just getting a flea bite high um yeah <laughs> i fs one ed uh no. just thanks for yeah. everyone because it's awesome yeah it's a good team effort I am Thea. Yeah, I mean that was that was really good. That was really really good. Um I definitely um I think it, it was definitely a a point where I'm like struggling with him going I want to do the thing that Callum would do as like I am the person controlling this person and I want to you know push plot and story and move everyone together but then I was like why do I have to make this character who wants 
to do this. Why? Why? Why can't I just be Gorg the Barbarian who just hits shit and follows the crowd? Um, Welcome to my plan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um, but no, uh, I like. I also, I like. I really loved like the um, the whole book thing with Alvin was just really cool. Like the whole visual of that and just the atmosphere of that whole like scene and sequence was just really cool. Um, um, and actually, hats off to to Scott as well. Like the actual interactions there and how like Alvin acted mm-hmm. through the whole thing and the, the urgency at the end that Alvin had while everyone else was just sort of chilling was on point. Um, and you know how he, how he reacted with the the thunderclap and everything was just ah. Yes. Yeah. That's exactly good. what would happen. Also, I'm mad, but at the same time, I'm not. And <laughs> Thea's mad. Callum is not. It was, it was just. <laughs> well, I'm glad I could entertain you. Yes. Yeah. Um, Though I've just realized that, yeah, I've got a bit of a grudge against Alvin now because I spent coin on that soup and drink. And none of us got to enjoy that. <laughs> oh. Sleep out, dude. Well. <laughs> You fed um, sleep out. Yep, sorry, Thea, continue. Yeah, I, I really like how um, Thea's flaw came up, mm-hmm. which is which is nice. Um, and yeah, it was it was just really nice to have that sort of because um, because I, I know a lot of um, GMs would just run the game that like that the whole that whole tavern scene would have been just blah 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 blah. We're gonna do this. Oh, dinner with the king. Um, it was nice to just have that freedom to just have and play out all those scenes with everyone's characters getting involved. And um, as you said, everyone had their time to shine. Um, and it was really interesting to see all the, the sort of interactions and you know, pro- kind of probably the first proper interaction between Thea and Fleabite mm-hmm. um, in game. Uh, so it was, it was, it was good to just get all that out of the way, even though you know, you know, some people would be like, ah, we didn't make any progress, even though we like character-wise made tons of progress. Yeah, that's just I think, which we've discussed yeah. at length in the in the past, uh, me and you. But mm-hmm. yeah, I think you've made tons of progress in terms of bonding with each other. I think. Um... If there was an audience, uh, first of all, thank you for listening to our nonsense so far. And secondly, <laughs> I think they would probably have a better grasp of how your characters are, because obviously you know in your heads what you are trying to like do, but seeing it from a third-party perspective is nice. And as far as I'm concerned, I think a lot of progress was made this particular session, maybe due in part to Alvin going exploring. Um, I went off on a bit of a tizzy. <laughs> Yeah, several chapters deeper than the rest of the team. Um, All I can say is thank God there was uh, no students in that library because right. you know. Um, Man, I would not have cared. I, I would have <laughs> we know. been like you would no. have just dropped a few gravity bombs in the way past, and yeah. I think it's also got to the point that where everybody's interacted with everybody. Like the first couple of sessions, like I focused on interacting with a couple of people, but I think at this point I've, I've interacted with each person individually, mm-hmm. and developed bonds like like the fucking sheet says mm-hmm. uh, and i think everybody has interacted with everybody so it sort of it is a cohesive mm-hmm. group that sure We're we had backstories and we talked about what we did in the year um since but now i think that we all understand how everybody works and what would have actually happened in that year mm-hmm. and how we would have got to know each other better as well it's good yeah it, feel, it feels like you've like been a team for a while as dysfunctional as you might still be, it still is what works for you guys, right? And it's nice to see yeah. that, even though uh, sometimes getting us on the one place at the same time is a bit difficult. Um, <laughs> but that's mm-hmm. fine. Well, that's that's all Thea's sailing skills. So. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're all on the same boat here. Except exactly. Um, but no, that was uh, really fun. Anything else you want to add at all, uh, Callum? Uh... Not that I can think of. Um, it was it was, you know, nice to have everyone in the same place at the same time. Even for that one. Um, I know I kind of ruined that in normal Callum fashion, but. Um, well, you had a date, so I mean. And Cognac helped pay for the date to happen, so. 
I am basically the daddy. Like, yes. Like there was a point where I was like, like oh, Theo will pay the last score. Oh, no, never mind. Cognat's got it. Never mind. <laughs> um, that was good. I'm very yeah. interested to see where that goes because, again, in Thea's mind, they're like, I don't think she picks up on any of those signals. It's just. Mm. She, she definitely wants to decide whether or not horses are a good thing or a bad thing. Um, yeah, and, and if, whether or not it becomes a euphemism from now on. Ah, you want to go see horses together? I see what you're. I see what you're saying. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. So next episode is Thea's wedding because she doesn't pick up on that stuff. Oh yeah, um, <laughs> that or she's been kidnapped. We don't know yet. Um, Shotgun wedding. Yeah, there you go. Uh, anyway, thanks everybody for playing. That was a lot of fun for me. Uh, and that was, yay! Yay! I, I think it was. I think it was a needed session. I think. Yeah, it was good mm. fun. Uh, and I will catch Enjoyed. everybody in the following the following session. Take care, everybody. Good night. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Bye.